The Federal Controller of Works in Lagos, Oluka Edipubola, says adjustments will be made on existing diversion points on the Lagos Third Mainland Bridge from January 15 to January 29. Pukbola debunked an earlier claim of a January 13 total shutdown of the bridge. He explained that consultations were ongoing with the Lagos State Government and other stakeholders towards shifting existing diversion point for construction works on the bridge for two weeks, starting from January the 15th. He said the existing traffic diversion arrangements were still valid, but the contractor would move the current diversion point toward Oroshoki and close the Adekunle Sleep Road on the Lagos Island-bound carriageway. Earlier in our news, the FRSC sector commander uh, Lagos State, Olusegu Ogungbimide, shed more light on the proposed diversion. Let me correct the impression that uh, is a total closure. It's still the continuation of the rehabilitation that is going on, and it is normal under the process of rehabilitation, there will always be some measures of inconvenience and measures being put in place. The closure they are doing is additional um, spans of the road from Adipuli end. So if you, you appreciate that the present diversion is from Adipuli end of the road, but two kilometers to that point, another diversion will be created. Why from Adipuli end to Adenigi Adile, the total closure will be done on inward Lagos Island. Why the other side of the road, that's Oworoshoki bond, is still open to traffic going to Highland in the morning and coming out of Highland as from 12 midday. It's a plan for the diversion from 15th of January to 29th of January. So outwards, that's inward Lagos Island will be closed down from Adipule end for the two weeks. That's the sacrifice we have been making in the last few months for us to have a safe bridge that one will be able to apply with any fear. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.